Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are checking out The Legend of Peach. Super Mario 64, well, Link in Super Mario 64's world. I've seen this pop up here and there, but I haven't watched the videos on it because I try to avoid... I guess I should be reading the sign. <laughs> I'll have to read it again. Uh, press B to use the sword and save and pause menu because items you can use them with C buttons. Tutorial. Ciao! Welcome to the Hyrule Kingdom. There's a quick reminder of what Mario, I mean, uh, Link can do. <laughs> Press A to interact with characters and roll into various objects. Press B to use your sword and save the pause menu. And when you get items, you can use them to see buttons. Cool. Yeah, so this is uh, kind of like Super Mario 64 Ocarina of Time. This is The Legend of Zelda. The Legend of Peach. So it's the other way around this time. And it's only a demo, so it's not that long. So um, let's see what all we got in here. Like I said, I've only I've seen the thumbnails of videos for this. And of course, I have to try it. It's just been on my list of uh, ROM hacks to try. And again, this is probably be a one video error because from what I've heard, it's pretty short. So I like how they did this. Um, we got Zelda on the window there. It looks more like Wind Waker Zelda, actually, than uh, Ocarina of Time Zelda, but it's still pretty cool. Got some chickens. What can we do, like, out here? We don't have magic with three hearts. Rupees. Bushes. I see a sign. I saw the sign. Da -da 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 That song. That was always a good song. I enjoyed that song, actually. Ace of Base. Alright, so what do we got in our pause menu? Hyrule Field. Uh, I don't think so. Well, it did say Hyrule Kingdom. Prelude of Light. I wonder where that goes. Usual starting equipment and the Ocarina. Okay. I should probably save it. Just to make sure our file sticks in case anything bad happens. We're back to using Retro Arch because we're not playing Zelda's birthday anymore, so hopefully we're not going to be dealing with a buggy mess. I see a piece of heart. Do you see an item or object that seems out of reach? Fear not, you will be able to get those once you progress through your quest and find various items. Hmm. So maybe Hookshot? Got some water. Ooh, there's a hole there that normally leads to... Well, normally that that's where you get kicked out after the um, the slide with the red coins in Mario 64. So normally you go down that hole first. Ooh, that's like... It's got a cracked part there. I wonder if you can lower the water and get down in there. Wee Splish. This is really cool. I like... Uh, I love seeing crossovers like this. Um... Like with Mario 64, Ocarina of Time, I, I'm loving that to death. And, uh, this is really kind of surreal, too. Seeing Peach's Castle, at least, and we're just on the outside. Like, we could probably go in, too. There's a door down there, at least to the creepy basement. Mario 64. I was watching a video the other day of, uh, Analog Horror, Mario 64. I love Analog Horror stuff, and Mario 64 stuff that's done well, like, analog horror-wise, I just eat that stuff up. Um, because I just love 90s, the 90s vibes and myst mystery surrounding, like, the analog horror stuff that I've seen. I know Markiplier plays a lot of analog horror. I've been watching a lot of his stuff lately. I love Markiplier. Um, but yeah, I love analog horror a lot. And Mario 64 creepiness always gets me, like, a certain way. Some people say that the water outside the castle can be drained by activating a switch inside it. Some people say that, hey? Oh, there's a chest down there. Yeah, I'll bet we definitely can... Ooh, level the water. I see a Triforce. Is this like an ocarina spot, or...? It's because playing Zelda's birthday, I'm paranoid about pausing it because it kept crashing during with the pause menu, but I like, had to remind myself that we're, we're playing normally again. Ooh, okay, so we don't have Zelda's lullaby or anything, so... Uh, that could be a problem. And there's a rock over there. Alright, let's go inside the castle. Yeah, this design, I love how they did this. Wind Waker Zelda. I kind of want to get on the roof. I wonder if that's possible eventually. Make sure recording's going good. Got my tablet on this side now. Oh wow, Zelda's castle. Yo. Oh, there's no uh, cloud to like go into the flying cap. Wing cap mini place. This is neat. I like the emblem on the bottom here. The footstep sounds aren't what I was expecting them to be. It's the ice sounds, but any song to play here? No. We can use our sword inside here. 
Yeah, I hope this becomes like a full thing because I would love to play like a full Mario 64 Ocarina of Time game. But with Link in Mario's world. <laughs> we have it the other way around. We just need it this way. So the spooters. Okay, so they do knock you back, but they don't they don't damage you. That's interesting. I'm just trying to hit him. Nothing. Okay. Do, 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 do. It would have been really cool if they had like uh like some of the Mario songs in Zelda font. Like with uh Mario 64 Ocarina having like the Zelda songs. Ooh. They even put the stained glass on the other side. I love the attention to detail. Alright, well it looks like the only place we can go is towards Baba on Battlefield. So let's do it. How are they gonna do the paintings? Okay, so there is a painting. Do do do. I can't roll properly. Okay, there we go. Some whoopies. Alright, how do we get into the painting? Oh, just like that. <laughs> oh, wow. So he's Hyrule Fields theme. A chest. Bob on Battlefield. They get the scrubs. The scrubs. It's pretty accurate uh, representation. I see silver rupees. We got some stuff to do. Oh no, are you with them too? Wait, you're green. That means you're one of us, right? You see those red scrubs starting stealing, started stealing our homes. They even painted them that ugly color. If you're going to run around here, could you help us out and defeat some of these mad scrubs? I'm sure they are holding many goods. Wait, those goods weren't stolen from our homes, right? <laughs> well, uh, I don't know. Hey, so uh, you've seen those other scrubs, right? I could fight them myself, but uh, let's just say I got a splinter from those crates over there and my foot hurts. <laughs> I surely can't fight like that. It would be suicide. Ow, 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 ow. I need to improve my acting skills. Your acting skills, huh? What are you trying to say? What are you, uh, what are you trying to say, huh? Get. Get your scrub. Get. Okay. So we got rupees laid out like the coins in Mario 64, which is neat. Let's bonk all the trees that we can find, because you never know what's hidden in there. Is there spooters? Golden spooters? Oh. Dodongos, baby Dodongos. Got the boulders. There's a switch. Ah. Ah. So it's the Goron City map, which is interesting. So is this uh, replacing the... What normally is Goron City? Can we get that? Oh, and I even grabbed the ledge too. That was pretty slick. All right, you, come here. Get. Overkill with the jump attack, but it works. Can we go up here? Oh. So there's gotta be a way to get that chest eventually. Ooh. Mitigated the, uh, ooh, I see a spooter. That's two silver rupees, right? So there is golden spooters. We just tried a gold skull Tola. So I wonder where we would turn those in at though. It's a very interesting question. I see a giant deckle scrub. Oh, that's a large boy. Oh, it was red. He's shooting red nuts. At oh, so only the blue ones? Oh, well, that was a happy accident. So the blue nuts were reflectable, but the red ones damaged me, it looks like. I wonder what this is. This could be hookshot. Bombs. Do, 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 do. Ah, the bomb bag. 20 bombs. What a lucky find. All right, so we have bombs now. We can blow up rocks. We can blow up the rocks. Did we, was there a rock over here? No, there wasn't. There was one outside. Oh, there we go. So, ooh, we gotta do a throw. Okay. And yeet. Yep, too late. Try that again. Too late again. Not used to them being low like this. What is this, a fatal bombiwa? <laughs> and that was too early. <laughs> Get. There it is. 
Beta Bobby with flashbacks. Get here. Hey. Hey. Ooh, that was a nice little uh, transition there. I was like, get out of here and then deflect the other one back at him. That was kind of cool, actually. I'm actually pretty proud of how I did that. Scratchy, scratchy. Alright, so those scraps are dead. Still silver rupees to find, it looks like. And we have bombs. So that's where we stand. Get another spooter. Gotta collect all the spooters. It wouldn't be awkward of time without getting spooters. That was fail. So that's two. Three. Bomb. I guess we can tap the switch over here. That make a shortcut back up here. Ah, oh, no, there's a little rupee too. Hey, nice. It's a little short to cut. Much appreciated. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I would love to hear uh, Bob on Battlefield's song in uh, Ocarina of Time sound. That'd be pretty cool. Maybe in the full game. This is only a demo, so. Maybe someday. Alright. We have bombs. I wonder, I wonder what other items are going to give us. I'm betting on getting the hookshot probably at some point, because, hey, I see you hidden in there. How do I, uh, wait, what? Can I backflip one? Hey, backflip for the win. Okay. Very, very nice. Ooh, caught him. Ooh, a fairy. I don't have any bottles, though. Hey, come here. I don't need you, but come here. <laughs> That's a fail for a minute there. Got the rolling boulders. Alright, so there was a rupee over here, so we gotta slide down and get that. Whoa! Hey. That's four, right? We only need one more to get the five. Whoa. Mind the rocks. Don't get bonked. Burn, burn. Can we uh do the little alcove warp? I feel like I'm gonna have a problem if rocks start rolling at me from here. Hey, what happens if you stand here like in Mario? Oh, <laughs> that was hilarious, actually. Oh, we got another bomb throw. Can we probably throw this on the other side and just blow it that way, right? I was trolled by that <laughs> little cave. It was just like, oh, you think this is a shortcut? Just kidding. Oh, wow. There's the last rupee. Uh, we need a hookshot. Maybe we'll find it at the top of this mountain. Uh, watch out. I wonder what the King bob going to be. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, excuse me. I spy a crate. Oh, wait. I saw something else there, too. Is that another rupee? Oh, oh. <laughs> again, smacked in the face by a boulder. Hello, scrub. Oh, hey, you're the new guy, right? Good job getting all the way up here. The leader of the mad scrubs is right at the top of this hill, so I've placed a heart in this crate just for you. Me? Nah, I'm way too scared to fight such a thing. Ooh. Okay. The leader of the scrubs, hey, another giant scrub. It's gonna work the same way as the other one? Is he gonna die in one hit? Excuse me? Hello? Oh, oh! Get it close. Okay, so we got red seeds again. Ow. Wow, to like... You need like reaction to- Oh! Need, no! <laughs> wow, you get like... Really knocked back far for that. Holy crap. Okay. You need like some reaction time to dodge the red ones versus reflecting the blue ones. It's a little bit of a challenge. Okay, and I'm taking some damage too, so hopefully I don't, uh... I don't die. That would kind of be bad. What happens if you die? Like, where do you go back to? Like, here? Or, or what? Oh boy. Oh boy. Ah. Yeah, that wasn't gonna work. And I'm gonna die. I only have one heart left. Okay, maybe we should wait. Yeah, wait for that to go by. And then let's be a little bit more careful with this scrub because there is not a lot of time to react to the red versus blue seeds. So. Let's try that again. Not get too close. Because he will hit you. Red. Red. Oh god, why? 
Man, you really have to just make a split second decision whether to sidestep or let it reflect. Because if you stand too far back and you get hit by a red seed, you're blasted off the edge. And then I don't want to sidestep the blue one. Unless it's a pattern. Does he shoot like two reds and then a blue? I feel like that's what's happened the past couple times. Shot like two reds and then a blue. Alright, wait for the rocks. Can I race it to the top? Don't hurt me, don't hurt me. Okay. Alright, we're up here again. We got the beeping, so that's always a joy. Let's do this a little bit smarter. Not get too close to the edge. Well, have better reaction time. Come on, come out. Come out. There you are. Alright, so red. Red. Is this going to be blue? Okay, it is. Alright. Oh god, no. Alright, red. Red. Blue. No, it's not. Oh, oh, come on. All the way down here again? Are you freaking kidding me? Oh my gosh. This is actually kind of hard. Unless I just really suck. <laughs> Which is a possibility. Has been known to happen. I just really don't want to die. Yeah, no. Okay. I can really use that fairy that I found in that crate again. <laughs> kind of regret grabbing that. Although... Probably wouldn't. Uh, excuse me. Probably because I hit the crate and the fairy would have wandered off anyway, so wouldn't have been really be able to do anything about that. Okay. What is this? Fourth time? Fourth time's a charm. Let's race the rock. At least I don't take damage if I get knocked off. I just get knocked off. <laughs> Now, does it count that I still had hits on him? And is it still going to be the same pattern? <laughs> Alright. Red. 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 Blue. Okay, one. Two. Three. Four. Blue. A. Get. Uh... Alright, red, red, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven is blue. Alright, nice. Easy peasy. Whoa! And we got warped back to the entrance, and now there's a chest. What do you have to say? Hey, green guy's back. Now that the mad scrubs are gone, we can enjoy our homes again. We couldn't have done it without you. I have placed a sign of our gratitude in this chest. I hope you like it. I hope I like it too. I think I will. I wonder how much more there is to this, because this is going to be a really short video. <laughs> ah, heart container. Okay. So... Ah, oh, the silver rupees are back too. Oh, and these guys... Oh, hey, green guy. Thanks for saving our homes. You're welcome. Okay, so... There's still silver rupees. How do I get that one that was on the floating island? Unless I can jump there somehow. I'm glad I'm not beeping anymore. Hey, it's Green Man. Guess what? My splinter went away when and I fought those mad scrubs. They totally ran away from me after I showed them my moves. <laughs> Was I convincing this time? Show me your moves. <laughs> Go on, Captain Falcon on them. Show me your moves. And there's still that chest up there, too. How the blazes do we get that? Daku Scrubs, you gonna help me out at all? Or, uh... well, there's still the uh, rock outside of Peach's Castle, too, so... Oh, hey, green guy. Thanks for saving our homes. You're welcome. You have the same dialogue as the other guy. Oh, hey, green guy. Thanks for saving our homes. Uh, you guys are more than welcome. Anytime. It was my pleasure. Okay, so... What is the plan now? Do they all say the same thing if I go talk to them? Probably. Oh, hey, green guy. Thanks for saving our homes. Hey, you said the same thing as the last guy. Let me guess. Oh, hey, green guy. Thanks for saving our homes. <laughs> All right. So I'm betting that... Prelude of Light. Did that take us back to Peach's Castle? And then we can check the rock outside with our bombs. And there's still water to drain, too. And the ocarina song to play at the Triforce outside as well. So how's that going to work? Hmm. Okay, so this takes us back here. So I was hoping. 
All right. Okay. So I guess this rock is our hope at the moment. Let's see what's hiding. What's hiding in the rock? And shoop. Bark, 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 bark. Ooh, a hole. A scrub. What do you have? All right, you win. In return for sparing me, I'll sell you a piece of heart. One piece for ten rupees. Let's make a deal. Oh. Okay. So it's a piece of heart. Hmm. Fascinating. So I wonder, can you use this chicken to get across to that piece of heart? I don't think so, because that gate, the gate's in the way. So what do we use the chicken for? Hmm. 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 Um, well, that's not how to help at all. Can I dive into... <laughs> no, I do not have diving time. Okay. So that's not an option. So what about the Triforce? Well, there's a chest inside the water. There's still a chest inside in Baba and Battlefield, too. There's got to be a way to get that without a hookshot. Maybe I'm just not, not thinking of it. I wonder... Yeah, I have some things I want to try to do that. But this... Yeah, it doesn't, that doesn't do anything at all. I don't have... Oh, I mean, I guess we could play this Prairie of Light for that? You can't warp here! <laughs> okay. So that's not the song. I only have one song. I have three spooters, though. It's gotta count for something, right? Okay. We read this sign, right? Some people say that the water inside the castle can be drained by activating a switch inside. Okay, yeah. That is already red. I really don't know like what all you can do in this, but I guess go back inside Bob on Battlefield. Because there's still the other silver rupee on the island and the chest as well that the cannon normally is. So there's gotta be something we missed. Something we can't something we didn't think to do. <clears throat> we gotta use what we can with the tools that we have at our disposal. <laughs> Which is an ocarina and a bomb. <laughs> so let's see. Alright, so you guys stayed saved. This is nice. Okay. There's gotta be a way to get that chest. Probably, like, if you can get onto that island. But how, though? Alright, one. We don't have any like hover boots or anything, right? Nope. We really don't have anything. I also didn't go back to the top of the mountain either now that the king scrub is gone. I did check that. Let's rip you down here. We should have been in red, like the red coins in Mario. That'd be funny. I forgot that that's also a shortcut. Okay. There's Rupee up there. One on the island. How the heck am I supposed to get over there? I wonder if I, like, positioned myself right with the red seed scrub if I could knock myself over there. That would be pretty funny. We'll come back for that coin down there. I want to go to the top first, actually. Just because. Rock, don't come at me. Yeah, that's like really far away. How the heck are you even supposed to get over there? Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, you did it. That's fine. I'm gonna get hit by this one too. Nope, just kidding. Alright, so. Oh, the scrub is gone. Okay. 
I can't even like cheat and side hop over there. I don't know how to like bomb hover. So that's not an option. Hmm. Hmm. Very peculiar. Yeah, I don't even think the red seed would have knocked me far enough back over there either. So I don't think that that was an option. Hmm. Alright guys, well I think what I'm going to do, because I really want that rupee, is enable like a cheat code or something like that that allows me to have items that I normally wouldn't have to get places. So hookshot for that and the chest down there as well, because I want to know what's in them. Okay, we're back with all items um, cheat enabled. So we have Hookshot, Megaton Hammer, Iron Boots, all that stuff. Probably shouldn't have put those on right now, but... <laughs> I think... Did we... Uh, okay, I do have Zelda by 2. I wonder if that works here. Yeah, because normally... There's no way to get Zelda Zolibi in this, so I wonder having it on with a cheat. Oh. Oh. All right. Hmm. Interesting. So the chest up there. Now, I didn't see a cheat to open chests underwater. So let me, um, uh, I wonder if I can open this chest down here. And I wonder what it is. You can't breathe underwater. Yeah. Yeah, I can't open that. I know there's a way to open chests underwater. I do have, um, moon jump enabled as well because I wanted to go on top of the roof. So let's, uh, let's explore around a little bit. <laughs> we can get that chest that's up here. I wanted to go on the roof anyway, so here we go. Woo! Woohoo! Alright, cool. Now, where'd the chest spawn? It's up here somewhere. Ah! What's this? Ah, it's hard. Or I have max hearts anyway, because I enabled the cheat. Like, is it gonna give me an extra one? And there's a piece of heart down here. Ah. So we can yeet ourselves out of this. Grab this piece of heart. Ooh, I can go down that hole too. I wonder what happens if I try and go down that hole. Wee Sploosh. Nothing. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, like, kind of slide. That's weird. Okay, so that's not a thing. Put on this other stuff too, because we can. We have them. Alright, so that's that. Um, That is a thing as well. I wonder if I can open this door underneath the... the thingy. Whee! Whee! Sploosh! Ah! Hey, sploosh. Oh! I wonder if it's going to break the game. I think I broke the game. I don't think I was supposed to be able to do that. <laughs> okay, uh, let's restart. Let's restart again. Because we got to go back into Baba on Battlefield to... Ah, uh, good old Retro Arch. Fast forward. All right, so those are pieces of heart. Can't open the chest under the water. I know there's a way to do it. I'm sure that there's nothing important in there though, because Ooh. can I like hover into the window? Nope. <laughs> Would have been kind of cool. All right, let's go back and bob on battlefield and check those two things. The wee, the rupees, the chest. Ah, it's not F4 on this. I'm not printing. Blah. Project 64 spacebar. Okay, there we go. What's this? Oh, it's a gold skull tulla. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be that, but ah, I missed. Okay. Hey, how did you get all the way up here? I should probably ask that same question to myself. Anyway, have you seen any skull tullas around? 
I've heard that they like to hide in big trees like this one right here next to me. Then again, I've never seen it myself. I guess the rumor is just a rumor after all. Unless... <laughs> oh, oh. Never would have thought he was alluding to that at all. That's pretty funny, actually. Alright, cool. So, not that. Ow. Is Rupee up here? We can go. <laughs> Got this one. Right up here. Ah. Cheat for this one. Ooh. Where was that? Was that over here? No, it wasn't. Where's that chest? Where did that. Uh, ow. Where'd that spawn? That was an epic fail. I'm like way out of control here. I think. Where did that chest spawn? Hello? Oh, right here. What is this? Oh, another gold scotola. Nice. Well, I think that's all that we're going to be able to do out here. I mean, it's clearly a extremely short demo. Um, unfortunately, I don't think it's being worked on from what I've seen anymore. So it's, it's a dead ROM hack, unfortunately, again. All these ROM hacks that have so much potential that just never get finished is really kind of sad because I would love to see a full on like every Mario world in Ocarina of Time someday. Maybe someday. Maybe someday someone will pick up the project again and uh, finish it. But that was The Legend of Peach. Neat little demo. Uh, definitely super short. I loved it. Again, it's a shame that it's probably not going to be finished. But um, what could have been, we saw. So if you guys enjoyed the video, I know it's a short one, I'm sorry, but uh, make sure you drop a comment, tell me what you think, and subscribe for more stuff like this, including Zelda randomizers that we're going to be doing, and working on Super Mario 64, Ocarina of Time as well, and I'll catch you in the next video. Until then, take care.